Today is an official holiday here in Texas, Texas Independence Day. We've got Good Day Austin's adopted Texan, Jacqueline Sarkeesian, here now with more on how the city of Austin is celebrating. Howdy, Jacqueline. Howdy. How are you, Dave? So if there's one thing Texans have, that's state pride. And believe it or not, it's been 182 years since the Republic of Texas officially broke from Mexico. Now, that happened when a declaration was passed by 59 delegates without any debate on March 2nd, 1836. When Texas was a part of Mexico, it officially broke from the country to create the Republic of Texas. This is video from previous celebrations. Texas remained independent for nearly 10 years before signing a treaty to join the union. A couple of born and raised Austinites started a group called Celebrate Texas. Their goal is to educate the public about the importance of Texas Independence Day and the history of the Lone Star State. I'm proud of Texas. And I've, uh, when I was in the Navy, I noticed not everybody in the Navy was proud of where they were from, but we Texans were damn proud of where we were. I am proud of Texas history, and I think that the uh, impact that Texas and its people have is uh, important to the nation, and I think that we do good stuff here. So grab your biggest cowboy hat and honor the beloved state of Texas by going to these events. The first one is later this morning at the state cemetery. Then there's a celebration at the Capitol later on sponsored by Senator Kirk Watson. Tomorrow is the big parade. And on Sunday, there's an Alamo ceremony on the south side of the Capitol grounds. Now, Dave, today isn't just Texas Independence Day. It's also Texas Flag Day and Sam Houston Day. Mr. Houston is turning 225 years old today. So happy birthday to him. Back to y'all in the studio. All right, Jackie. Thank you very much.